Greeting, folks. Great to have you back. El Rushmore and the Cutting Edge Societal Evolution. Your guiding light. Happy to be with you. Half my brain tied behind my back just to make it fair. Again, the phone number, if you want to be on the program, is 800-282-2882 and the email address. L. Rushbo at eibnet.com. Yes, here we have a random act of journalism from NBC News. And the headline, Condoleezza Rice, uh, AIDS, uh, Colin Powell, also got classified information on personal emails. Yes! So you see, there's nothing to see here regarding Mrs. Clinton. Why? Colin Powell, the titular head of the Republican Party, one of the greatest moderates ever to have lived. If anybody will ever have a book written about them, great moderates in American history, it will be Colin Powell. That book doesn't exist, by the way. You ever seen great moderates in American history? You just haven't seen it. Great line crossers in American history. The great compromisers in American history. You don't see those books, but you will see it about Colin Powell. State Department officials, State Department, this is the place where Hillary Clinton used to work, keep in mind. State Department officials have determined that classified information was sent to the personal email accounts of former Secretary of State Colin Powell and the senior staff of former Secretary of State Condoleezza Rice, NBC News has learned. <gasps> In an interview with NBC News, Colin Powell challenged this, saying nothing that went to his personal account was secret. Condoleezza Rice did not respond initially to an interview request. In a letter to Undersecretary of State Patrick Kennedy, dated February 3rd, State Department Inspector General Steve Linick said that the State Department has determined that 12 emails examined from their archives, contain national security information, now classified secret or confidential. Two of the messages were sent to Powell's personal account, and ten were sent to personal accounts of people that worked for Condoleezza Rice. How timely! Right after a Democrat debate, do you realize that didn't even come up in the debate last night? Do you realize that? Not one quick at 150 FBI agents pursuing the case, not one question about this for Mrs. Clinton. 